Right, and today I just wanted to tell you about a little story about when I went to Egypt on holiday. So, basically, because of everything that happens now in the world, I get a bit paranoid. It's kind of like, fuck, yeah, I don't really want to go on a plane without, like, being out of it, like, asleep the whole time. So, like, I've gone to the doctors and I was like, oh, yeah, um, please can I have some uh, stuff for when I go on the plane because I'm really scared and, like, I just don't want to really like experience it. I just want to get there. So they were like, yeah, okay then. We'll give you uh, some Zofacom, but we can't give you them long term, obviously, because you don't need them long term. And like, because you can get addicted to them and this, that, the other, but because you're like responsible and you're not going to abuse them and you're not likely to abuse drugs, um, we'll give you them. So like, they gave me like four or whatever. So then like, I've gone on holiday, got on the plane, and like took two of them. And then like they've done nothing to me whatsoever. So I've been like, let's take these other two. So then like I took the other two and they still like didn't really do much. I was obviously more like chilled and like a bit more relaxed, like, but I wasn't asleep, which was the desired effect, so fuck. So anyway, I got there, I was safe, I was alright, and then um I've gone on holiday, whatever, I had a good holiday. And then, like, towards the end of the holiday, we had this, like, amazing idea that we'll go to the chemist and go and ask for the drugs that have been prescribed. So I was like, yeah, that's what we'll do. So we've gone to the chemist, me and, like, my ex-boyfriend or whatever. And then, like, we've gone and been like, oh, yeah, have you got some Zopicon, please? That's what we want. So they're like, yeah, yeah, wait there one minute. So then, like, they come back, give us them, and, like, we're, like, found, and they were, like, called Zoped Drone or something. Like, maybe not that, but <laughs> something that was, like, resembled Zopicon, just sounded like the Egyptian equivalent or whatever. Didn't really question it because it had the same start. So we just thought, yeah, he's right, that's what it is, sound. So then, like, we'd gone to, like, the airport, got on the plane. And then, like, my boyfriend was into taking them, ex-boyfriend was into taking them as well. And he was like, um, do you need to? I have to. So, like, we took two, and he's just fallen asleep straight away. So I was like, oh, these must be good. But I still didn't fall asleep. So I was like, what the fuck? So then, like, um, been there, obviously, but I've been more chilled, and, like, I didn't take any more, because I was on my own at this point. He was just fast asleep, so I thought I'm just going to, you know, lay low with these two, see how it goes. So then, like, I've took them, been found, not really been anything the whole time. Like, I just felt more, like, relaxed and, like, you're not as, like, worried about everything. But, like, I wasn't asleep like he was. So, like, I wasn't, like I said, I wasn't too bothered about, like, the condition that I was in. I was just like, fuck it, this will do kind of thing. Just chilled with my two being in me. So then, like, got to the UK after about five or six hours or whatever. Got off the plane, gone home, and then we've been like, oh, should we get a little bag of heat and uh, get a bag of weed? Because, like, I don't know. We just thought, yeah, we will. Because, like, we've just got back off holiday and we're a bit rough and everything because we've been travelling for fucking ages and taking them things. And But, yeah, we'll just get a little bag, have a few lines, and then have um, a few joints and that. So then, like... So we've done that, and then like, we're like, right, should we go to bed now? Yeah. So then we're like, oh, yeah, we've got them pills, haven't we? So um, we decided to like double drop like two of them each and then go to sleep. And then like everything that I'm about to tell you from now, I only remembered and they only pieced together in the morning. So it's like fucked up, basically. But like, basically, we've gone to sleep and then like, we've just like been like rolling round each other but like head his head there my head there rolling round just like really fucking weird and then like we both stood up and then like all I could see when I like got like close to it all I could see was like eyes underneath his eyes and it was like flickering and it was fucking making me laugh my head off I was like pissing myself laughing like and it was making him fucking freaked out. And he was like, can you stop it? You're scaring me. But, like, I don't have any recollection of him speaking to me, really. I was just fucking laughing my head off. Because I never tripped like that before, ever in my life. And, like, somebody had eyes there. Trust me, it's fucking funny. You are laughing your head off. It is piss funny. 
So, I'm just laughing my head off, and then he's like walking away because he's like, he's freaking me out, he's freaking me out, and I'm just walking closer because he's making me laugh. And then, like, I've been going on for about an hour, I'm fucking just laughing my head off, laughing like a fucking freak. And then, like, we sat up next onto the bed next to each other because we've just been like stood up, but like walking closer to each other the whole time for fucking ages. So, we just like sat down on the bed next to each other and like we were trying to talk but we couldn't speak it was like our our speech was just fucked up we couldn't speak it was like and i was making all noises and i couldn't like talk i was just making noises and he was speaking but it was like like someone had like like put it on slow motion and he was like what mate i can't and it was like fucked up i couldn't even speak i was just like oh 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 making fucking like monkey fucking noises or like i don't know what i was just like fucking i couldn't even speak that was just me gone and he was trying to like communicate with me <laughs> he couldn't because <laughs> i was just like out of it and he's like fucking on slow motion so by the time he's like got his fucking word out i'm like oh oh making fucking random fucking noises so then um, we decided to just sit down together and we're like right let's just chill and try and like calm down calm down so then like this had been going on for quite a while for like two or three hours so like we've gone to bed and then like gone to sleep obviously because we're like fucked because we've been traveling for days and then like fucking all this mad shit's happened and we've been like active in this fucking trip so like we've just like zonked out gone to sleep because we were knackered physically and then like we woke up in the morning and i'm like what the fuck happened last night seriously like what the fuck and then like we sat there and spoke to each other and like pieced together what happened because like he could only remember what was happening to him and I could only remember what I saw, if you know what I mean. So it was like piecing together the night, well, the like morning trip by like our stories with each other. So it was pretty fucked up. And that's why we're like, right, so how the fuck has this happened? Because, do you know what I mean? Beak isn't, cocaine isn't a like hallucinogenic or whatever the fuck they're called. It's not. So how has this happened? Do you know what I mean? like seriously so we're like hmm we'll google them drugs because like they weren't actually called like zopiclon they were called zopi -da -da -da. so we like googled it and like basically it's like fucking some mad like sleeping pill drug that like if you take consecutively on like two days one after the other it turns it into like an acid trip but like a dead good one and like all these people are like yeah i'm like an acid and a mushy head been taking them for like 30 years and all this and like that zoppy da -da 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 is like awesome it's the best one i've ever had it's like six hours non-stop good trips no bad come downs and all this bullshit we were like oh my god what the fuck is he taking seriously like what the fuck and then like basically we were just fucking tripping out of the fact we'd taken this like well we weren't tripping but we were just like oh my god what the fuck it was just mad that we'd taken this like drug that had just like made us fucking trip all night long basically so we got the drugs and fucked them off and never took them again so the la and yeah we learned the lessons and math is one and like the lesson obviously is don't take drugs from anywhere that you don't know what they are at all obviously and if like they've got a little leaflet thing in them read them if they're not in english don't take them because you do not know what's going to happen or what's even better if you really 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 want to take them because like you need to go on this flight or whatever like i did and like you don't know like is what the fuck they are if you're not like 100 percent certain then just google it before you take them <laughs> obviously and then you won't be in that situation like of tripping your head off by accident so yeah i hope you enjoyed my story thanks for listening and i'll see you soon